Are you ready to listen to a story? Our story today features pluralization of irregular nouns. Before we begin, let us find out what these words mean. Persuading. Ella Aguila. Ella Aguila lived in a forest along with other animals. Every day, all the young birds, including Ella, would go to the biggest Nara tree because that's where they held their classes. Ophelia Owl was their teacher. One day, teacher Ophelia Owl was late for school. It was already past 9 a.m. and yet she wasn't there. Let's go and just play elsewhere, said Mimi Maya. Why don't we go to the town and play with the children there, suggested Kiko Kalapati. All the other birds agreed to their plan, except for Ella Aguila. I think we should stay here and wait for Teacher Ophelia, Ella said. But she's not here, and nobody will stop us anyway, Mimi insisted. Perhaps she's just running a little late. If she couldn't make it to class, I'm sure she would have told our parents ahead of time, Ella answered. But what if she's not really coming? We're just wasting our time here, said Kiko. Let's just go, said Mimi as she prepared to fly. All their classmates also prepared to fly, but Ella just remained seated on the branch. Aren't you coming? Mimi asked. I'll just stay here, and besides, my parents wouldn't be happy if they found out I went to the town without them. Ella answered. The other birds paused. They too probably realized that their parents wouldn't be happy if they found out they left school just so they could play elsewhere. Just then, Ophelia Owl came. I'm so sorry I'm late, she said. I'm glad you stayed here and waited for me, she added. Mimi and Kiko nervously looked at each other, quite afraid Teacher Ophelia might find out they were persuading their classmates to leave. But before anyone could say anything, Ella Aguila answered, Yes, Teacher Ophelia, we were just all patiently waiting for you, she said, as she gave Mimi and Kiko an assuring smile. They proceeded with their class and as soon as Teacher Ophelia dismissed the class, Mimi and Kiko approached Ella. Ella, thank you for not telling Teacher Ophelia what we almost did, Mimi said. We would have gotten in big trouble if she found out. Kiko added, Don't worry about it. At least you didn't do it, right? Answered Ella. We'll listen to you next time, Ella said Mimi. You're right. It's better to stay here together, Kiko added. Ella smiled at them. Well, I'm glad you're here. Now let's go home, she said. And Ella, Mimi, and Kiko flew together back to the safety of their homes. Where did the story happen? Who is the main character of the story and where does she go each morning? What does she do there? Who teaches the birds? What happened one day? What did Mimi Maya and Kiko Kalapati want to do? Did Ella agree to their plan? Why not? What did she say to them? And how did the other birds react? What could have happened to Mimi and Kiko and the other birds had they gone to the town? What can you say about Ella Aguila? Now let's take a look at this sentence. Why don't we go to the town and play with the children there? Suggested Kiko Kalapati. Who will Kiko see in the town? Children is an example of an irregular noun. Irregular nouns do not follow plural noun rules, 
so they must be memorized or looked up in the dictionary. Do you still remember other examples of irregular nouns? Name them. 